We have a very special guest in studio with us today, Mr. George Lorac. George, thanks so much for joining us. Thanks for having me. My pleasure. George, you played for Michel Terrier in juniors again, and then again in Pittsburgh. He gets a lot of flack from people who say that he's not a good enough or inspiring enough coach to lead a team to the Stanley Cup. What do you think about that? I think that over the years he's improved a lot. Um, you know, junior hockey was totally different. I think that when he came to the pros first, he, w he had more that junior mentality. But after the, the episode that, that happened in Pittsburgh, they was gone and they won the cup. Uh, obviously, that's hard on any coach that gets fired and the team win the cup when they're gone. But uh, he learned a lot. And when he came back for his second stint in Montreal, he's a much better coach uh, and better uh, man to be behind the bench. So uh, I wouldn't say that he doesn't have what it takes to uh, make it and to win the Stanley Cup. George, you were known as one of the greatest fighters in the NHL of your time. What player today would you most not like to fight? Uh, to be honest with you, there's no players I'd like to fight. Uh, fighting is not something that I like to do. I did it because it was my job, but it was never fun. And actually, believe it or not, every time you get into a fight, uh, it crosses your mind that you could die. So it doesn't yeah. matter the size of the guy. Uh, you get a punch at the right time, you fall on the ice, hit your head on the ice. You don't know what can happen. So, uh, no, I never liked uh, fighting anyone, so I would say no one. When you came to Montreal, you had to change your number from 27 to 17 because Alexei Kovalev was 17. Did you hate him for it? And if so, how did you make him pay? No, actually, I didn't hate him. I, I knew that, you know, he was a legend here yeah. and he had that number, so I couldn't take it. Uh, th the sad part about it is the second year that he was gone, I wanted to take it. Uh, Bob Gainey said no because they, they, was, they sold too much merchandise, but my name is number 17. So it would be unfair to the fans. And also, there's a riot. I don't remember that second year because people wanted Kobe to be back mm -hmm. and that his number uh, with him. So. It would have looked really bad if they changed by number 27.